With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is how can you, uh, how can the following conversions be brought about? Nitrobenzene to para-amino uh, azobenzene. Okay, this is a dye. Para-amino azobenzene is a dye. So you have to convert uh, nitrobenzene to this dye. Okay. So nitrobenzene means a uh, benzene ring having a NO2 as a substituent, right? So when uh, nitrobenzene reacts with 6 hydrogen in the presence of SN and HCl, it leads to the formation of aniline, okay? Now when this aniline reacts with benzene disonium chloride, right? When it reacts with benzene disonium chloride, which is N2, plus Cl minus, right? This is N2 plus Cl minus. I'm writing it here. So what really happens is that if to uh, make the understanding easier, we can write this NH as NHH. So loss of HCl takes place, right? And on rearrangement, this leads to the formation of a benzene ring, N double bond N, then a benzene ring, and then NH2. Right, so basically on rearranging, we get this para amino azo benzene. Right, so this is what your para amino azo benzene is. Okay, so when uh, aniline reacts with benzene disonium chloride, the loss of HCl takes place. Right, and on losing H, uh, on losing HCl and on rearrangement, we get the compound this, which is para amino azo benzene. So this is how you can prepare it using nitro benzene as the starting product, starting uh, material. Right, that's all for the question. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.